Uh, what is going on boys and girls welcome to the first ever video not video not the first what, what am I doing the first ever entire video that is a vlog video for 2013 welcome everybody my name is Orb. my name is Joel but you probably all already know that before we get into the question I just want to ask you when is the appropriate time to throw out the Christmas tree I, I don't know these things so maybe you can let me know in the comment section below or am I already too late should it already be out the window or out the door let me know but anyways what I want to talk about today is something I get asked a lot as far as you know staying healthy and staying on your road to becoming more healthy and that is you know when friends and family ask you hey do you want to go to the movies or do you want to go to you know grab some food over at McDonald's or do you want to you know just come over to my house and chill and eat chips like what do you do how do you you know stay away from that or how do you tell them nicely to I don't want to eat your unhealthy food like how do you do that that can be quite demanding and that is something I've dealt with too so I know exactly what you're going through and something I'm gonna tell you right away is that you're gonna have to separate yourself from that lifestyle whatever it is that is unhealthy that you want to stay away from you gotta distance yourself from that and of course I've said this before it all comes down to priority would you prioritize spending time with your friends over getting healthy make your plans very clear as to what you want to accomplish do you feel like spending time with your friends and and eating chips with them or you know going and eating food with them is is of higher priority than getting healthy then by all means do that but you gotta prioritize things so you know when to say no and also I would say tell your friends tell your close friends tell your family especially your family if you're younger I'm guessing a lot of you are, are, are younger and you still live at home you have to tell your family what's going on okay I want to stay healthy I want to eat healthy stuff so when you you know leave cookies out you know at the kitchen table or or you always you know every Friday we always eat junk food that's not gonna work for me so I need an alternative or you know mom or, or dad can you teach me how to cook because nutrition is really really important while staying healthy and something I haven't grasped until a few months ago uh, and really you know gone my, my my cooking game getting my nutrition down a pat and getting you know healthy stuff in my system because nutrition is super super important some bodybuilders and some trainers out there will tell you that if you don't think about your nutrition don't even bother training don't even bother going for building muscle because there's no way you will ever build muscle if you don't have the nutrition down pat so nutrition is very very important so you have to stay away from the unhealthy foods as much as you can of course having cheat days and stuff like that is something i would recommend i'm doing that myself and something i would definitely urge you to do uh every what two weeks three weeks or so depending on how i mean you can you can customize that after your own needs and uh, I mean if you're still losing weight while having a cheat day every week then by all means do that until you can't do that anymore and then you you know may have to expand your your time uh, before you get that cheat day but perhaps you know two weeks or three weeks etc and something that may be really important and will also suck really bad is that you have to say goodbye to certain amount of friendships and of course once again it comes back to prioritization do you feel like friendships are above getting healthy then by all means do that but if you're sick of being unhealthy and you're sick of not being able to change you may have to look at your friends and look at their habits and see what is going wrong in that department because if you have really unhealthy friends or really overweight friends who you know really like to go to mcdonald's for for lunch at school or they you know want to go out partying every single weekend that is not going to benefit your goals with whether you want to gain muscle or lose weight or just stay overall healthy that's not going to benefit you you have to surround yourself with supportive people and this is really really important you have to let your circle of friends and family know what you're going through you need to tell them that you know it's it's not going to be beneficial for me if you tell me each and every day that oh come on dude you can have some chips or you know my mom gave me a lot of criticism for being super healthy when I was training really hard and I was really strict on my diet uh, she always asked you know sort of comments here and there about oh why can't you you know enjoy yourself a bit you've been working out so hard why don't you enjoy some dessert or some chips or some cookies or there you know whenever I opened the fridge there was soda there or something along those lines and my mom always used to tell me that oh okay Joe watch out so you don't get an eating disorder and obviously she was looking out for me but I had to tell her I had to lay down for her that you know these types of comments are not gonna help me out you know you're gonna wake up some days so you're not gonna feel like a million bucks and whenever you get those comments saying oh you know grab some 
some cookies or have some of this or you know indulge yourself you've been working out so hard that is going to give your mind and your brain the time to doubt your goals so it's going to give your mind and your brain the time to say you know what i have been working out pretty hard maybe i should grab maybe i should get some cookies maybe i should you know give myself a treat for all the hard work and that is going to stray you away from your path to becoming more healthy and becoming more you know breaking away from your bad habits and that is not something that you want so finally surround yourself with people that are supportive and with people that want you to go in the right direction and something that is especially common in your circle of friends is that whenever you bring out something healthy or when you're trying to become healthy or you're you know the topic that you want to talk about most of the time is fitness or health or you want to talk about calories or protein or whatever the case may be you want to talk about something that has to do with you know staying healthy or becoming more healthy when you're breaking away from your bad habits that is reminding them that they're having bad habits and that is not something that they want so picking your circle of friends and picking your 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 people that you surround yourself with is really important to becoming more healthy and sometimes you have to cut loose with some friendships and before you do that something i would recommend you tell them tell them how you feel tell them ask them how they feel about it and sort of just go from there that would be my pro tip so guys i hope you have enjoyed this little vlog i definitely want to do more of this and the last time i asked you guys if you wanted more vlogs you told me that yes so i definitely want to do this more uh, please let me know in the comment section below if you have any questions about what we talked about today or if you want me to cover something in an upcoming vlog or an upcoming commentary or an upcoming whatever the case may be or if you just have a question for QA, let me know in the comment section below and uh, yeah that will be everything guys so rate the video as you please add it to your favorites and share it with friends if you really enjoyed it and that is going to be everything guys so have an incredible day and i will see you next time later guys bye